Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at 10 blister packs of each of Photon Hypernova and Maze of Memories. We're coming off of one of our better pull videos, probably our best pull of all time, in the Baron de Fleur Collector Rare that we got out of our Maze of Memories booster box. We want to follow up that hot streak and see if we can continue that in this video in either getting a Starlight out of Photon Hypernova or another Collector Rare out of Maze of Memories. I want you to leave me a comment right now and predict which one of these sets of packs is going to produce the best pulls in this video. Obviously, Photon Hypernova has the Starlights, some of which have incredible value, but after that, the set drops off really hard. There are some good secret rares, but the Ultras start to fall off really quickly, whereas Maze of Memories, Baron de Fleur really carries the set, but the Collector's Rares are really decent, as well as there are good Ultra Rares, including an Ultra Baron de Fleur. So, It'll be interesting to see which one of these sets really carries it out, whereas Maze of Memories is also guaranteed an Ultra in every pack. Photon Hypernova is not. So it'll be interesting to see. Let me know what you think is going to produce the best pulls here. Before we get started, make sure you leave that comment. Uh, and if you do leave a comment on this video, you will be entered in the giveaway. Be sure to be a subscriber as well. We're giving away a copy of the Starter Deck Kaiba Reloaded uh, that you get in that uh, legendary collection. So we'll give away that, leave your comment, let me know, make your predictions now, and I'm gonna unbox these, take them out of the blisters, and then we'll break into the openings, we'll fly through them, and we'll see what we get. We'll start with Photon Hypernova, and then see what we get in Maze of Memories. I'll catch you in a second, and we'll see what happens. Let's go. All right, we're back at it. We're out of the packaging. We got all 10 packs of each here. I think I said that you're guaranteed an Ultra in Maze of Memories. That would have been a misspeak if I did say that. You're not. So, correcting the record here. Let's get into Photon Hypernova and see what we get. We're going to fly right through these. Uh, we're not going to do any tricks on them. And let's see what we get. So, we've got XYZ Align, Dynamondo, we got Chaos Beast, Core of Chaos, and we have an Ultra Rare in Bear Graham, Shield, or sorry, Shield Emperor of the Forest Crown. So, we have an Ultra Rare. As a hit on the first one again not one of the best ultra rares but it's an ultra rare so chalk that one up in the win column for photon hypernova since those are not guaranteed all right we got gigantic thundercross we got yager maru we got photon emperor we got intimidating ore and we have back-to-back -back ultra rares in orphabool the harmonious bullfighter bard two ultra rares and then we'll just go through these real quickly uh, since these commons are not gonna do anything to help us uh, in our total so photon hypernova is coming in strong two for two on the hot streaks maze of memories got some catching up to do so photon emperor cash Tira overlap abyss actor and just ultimate great insect and we'll just go through and pass by the remainder there. All right, Numeron Creation, Evil Eyes Unleashed, Giant Ball Game. Oh, we'll just skip right to Tri Brigade Arms Bucephalus. And that would have been great if that was the Collector Rare from, I'm sorry, the Starlight version. All right, flip these around. Abyss Actor. We got Giant Ball Game. We got Bistio Baldrake. Light of the Branded. And Plunder Patrol Ship Jord. Plunder Patrol Ships are not going to happen. Not going to be a thing. They got to stop turning those. Looking forward to our anniversary collection coming out here in... Two weeks, uh-oh, we might have skipped to it. We got Humongous Hive Hegemon, which is just a super rare horse hat. So we started off hot, we got a bit cold since. Uh, so let me get that text from the bottom of the board out of the picture here. Light of the Branded, Abyss Script, uh, Gishki Grimness, 
All right, Abyss Actors Dress Rehearsal card stick on me here. Uh, wraps us out for that pack. So two Ultras, the Blister Pack again will run you nearly five bucks with tax. So if you're not pulling that much uh, in dollar value, again, you're pretty much losing. So uh, I wouldn't recommend Blister Packs as my means of buying cards by any mean, but we got Arctos the 12th, uh, which is just a super rare. Wouldn't be my preferred method, but I want to see, and I'm still convinced that somewhere on these uh, blister packs that you can pick up at Target and Walmart and everything, that they're hiding secrets, or not secrets, uh, Starlight Rares and Collector's Rares on me. Again, skipping through by accident to the super rare in the pack here. See if maybe I can keep the camera from focusing on me like that a little bit. All right, the autofocus is just killing me. We got Light of the Branded. This is our last Photon Hypernova pack, XYZ Align. And then we got Tier Laments, Kashtira. Another ultra rare to pull out for the set. Decent ultra rare tier limits and cash tier always play well, but uh, do not give us anything good. Uh, so we do not have a starlight. We have three ultra rares and seven supers for the set. Maze of Memories though, so there's the lose. A collector rare will seal the deal. So let's see what we get. Can we get another collector baron? That would be absolutely perfect we got treacherous trap hole overlay network uh, is just a super rare in the set so um, we did not on first pack let's go through the second but 25th anniversary uh, edition of the legendary collection comes out in two weeks so we got a display case of it coming gonna open that up really looking forward to getting into that will be an absolutely fun opening already see that we're just going to get wind up kitten as an ultra so we do get a hit as a pull so we're only down two in the ultras on amazing memories thus far with eight packs to go be a good start to get to get to jump into that see we get see what that quarter century rare looks like that's Swedish. We got Gate Guardian of Water and Thunder, so that's just a super rare. And then we'll see just a couple of rares to wrap us out here in the end. See if we can get anything good. See how the cards are going to be branded to differentiate them from the older reprints of those packs. That'll be uh, one of the things that I think a lot of people will want to see how that's going to happen. They're going to have any sort of... 25th anniversary, so another super here with Gate Guardian of Thunder and Wind. See how they're going to be branded. Uh, then differentiate them from the prior reprints of Legend of Blue Eyes, Metal Raiders, etc. See if they get anything other than just the copyright update down in the bottom. So this is going to be our fifth pack of Maze of Memories. Got Gate Guardian here in the front, Imperial Iron Wall. And then Super Ancient Deep Sea Colacanth is a super rare, so we won't have a hit in this pack. Maze of Memories not coming in strong. We burned all our luck on the uh, on on the Baron Psy Beast. It's just a super. So again, we're we, we've used it all up. It's my only my only hit I'll get all year. Unless I buy hundreds and hundreds of uh, cases. Solemn Judgment. Great. Great super rare. Uh, I don't think we can count that as a hit, though. Might uh, might add to the value, though, of the box. Might, might outweigh one of those prior Ultras from Photon Hypernova. So if you, if you chose Photon Hypernova right now, you're looking good with only three uh, Maze of Memories packs remaining. We got Imperial Iron Wall. And Gate Guardian of Water and Thunder. So I think that's the trifecta on those. We won't end up with anything else in this pack. 
one day, one day I'm going to knock another, another collector out of, uh, the blisters. We got overload fusion gate guardians combined. Uh, is that a, is that the one that I'm missing of the gate guardians from this? So again, we haven't hit anything on a maze of memories pack. We're down to the final one photon hypernova. You guys are winning right now. A collector rare is the only thing that can stop you. So maze of memory people, you chose them. This is your, this is your last chance. This is your only shot. We got Kazajin, we got Treacherous Trap Hole, and Mech Knight Crusadia Avramax. That's a bane of my existence in Master Duel right there, but doesn't do you guys any good if you picked Maze of Memories to win. So we got Wind Up Kitten. Wind Up Kitten was the only pull from Maze of Memories against the three. Tier Laments Kashira, and then Orphable and Bear Graham, the Shelled Emperor. So, tough luck today. Didn't follow up uh, our Baron de Floor with anything great, but we'll end it well, and we'll catch you guys when the Anniversary Edition comes out, and if we have anything good to open in between then. We do have the uh, Speed Duel box, uh, but probably won't open that since those promos are the only thing that differentiates uh, what people get. So I appreciate you guys stopping in. Be sure to um, leave a comment on the video and be subscribed to enter the giveaway for the Kaiba uh, Reloaded box. And we'll catch you all in the next one. Take care.